Hi there, I'm Paul Thompson from Spitfire Audio. Um, I've got, we've got a couple of um, cool new libraries that we're showing at Music Mesa this year. Um, this is one that we premiered uh, just recently. It's a library called The Grange. It's a drum library. Uh, we recorded with three drummers, Roger Taylor from Queen, Chad Smith from Red Hot Chili Peppers, and Andy Gangadine, who um, famously plays on a lot of dance records. He played on uh, Massive Attack's Mezzanine, that great sound. So three very, um, very different drummers, but all have a fantastic sound. And Headley Grange is a private residence that played um, host to a number of rock bands. I think Bad Company recorded their first album there. Um, uh, Genesis recorded there and famously Led Zeppelin recorded there, recorded a few albums there um, and the great When the Levy Breaks drum sound is recorded there in the in the hallway with a kind of tiered wooden staircase, interesting stone floor. It's a beautiful house and um, it's not uh, the last time that anyone recorded in there was Led Zeppelin recording in there so it's been, um, nobody can get in there uh, but we were very lucky to be invited in um, by the current owners. And so we went in and we took a two inch tape machine, a whole load of great Neve preamps and recorded um, this drum library really to do, it, to do it the kind of justice and record it as nicely as possible. We had the, the drummer's own drum techs in setting up the kits properly and, and it's a really fantastically recorded, um, recorded library. Nick Taylor recorded it for us. Um, within the library, there are a variety of different ways of, of um, accessing the sounds. You've got a section called Easy Tweak, which is the one we're looking at now. This has a tight mix, a, a kind of ground level, slightly more distant mix, um, the first floor and the second floor. So these can be switched on and mixed in this, um, in this kind of more basic mic mixer. We've got a kit mic section where you can dial in and go into more detail with the individual mics on the, on the actual kit parts themselves. There's another mix section which gives you a, a couple of different perspectives and then stereo. So there's a couple of different ways of going in and uh, accessing all the different recordings. When you're, when you're using this in contact, you can then um, set different outputs and produce a kind of true multi-track mic uh, drum recording. So um, in here, basically, you've got um, the, drums, the drums are mapped out in a kind of as close to general MIDI as possible, but with the extra elements in here. But you've got you've got um, the usual kind of control from the keyboard. But within here, there's quite a complex um, system where you can uh, there's a help system available to tell you how to do this. But you can remap everything if you're um, an eDrum user and you want to map to kit parts. It's incredibly simple. You can just click on here remap to um, by hitting the drum part you'll see that that's immediately remapped to the key that I just hit there so um, it's a very uh, controllable system as an extra bonus to the actual kits you've also got uh, real audio loops which work um, incredibly well to be uh, to tempo map to your sequence and there's a ton of stuff in here played by Roger Chad and Andy some really incredible stuff and again you know variations of different loops and lots of different styles so there's a ton of stuff in here to keep you happy um, and then obviously you program your own grooves um, using the just from the keyboard or from the kit using the individual drum hits themselves sounds like a wonderful product thank you very thank much you. and uh, we'll see you later great to meet you bye bye, -bye.